make her face the screen. There we go. Yeah, that do be making sense, though. <laughs> uh, I'll do that there. Oh, it's splat zones now. Neat. Woot woot. Oh, it's so small now. I think I made it too small. I also didn't put it up enough. Thanks for the prime sub link for the 11 months. Holy... holy schmoly. That's a lot. I'll make it bigger and move it up a little bit. There we go. I'm also trying a weird new layout that I'm probably going to end up hating and switch back immediately, but we'll see. It might be better. I have the old one still. Yo! I need to see what that looks like. Ooh, that's really small and down there, huh? Uh, I could bear to move that up. Need more Pikachus. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, it's a flop. Shut up. <laughs> could also make the text bigger. I could also do like one of the fucking like the box view where you like type and it shows up like that.
kind of awesome. Perfectly placed. Flopma. And if it's like that, then I can just do this. And then I can leave it permanently there. Just put it there. Alright. Just move it up a little bit. Flop. <laughs> Make sure it's not in the way of the game UI mid-match. It shouldn't be. I'll double check when we get in, but I don't think it is. I'll do like that. And then it's always there, and then it should be fine. If I have to move chat, then I have to move chat too. This is fine. I'm okay with the boxes like this. I think this is okay. Ugh. Gods. Alright, we're gonna check the lobby and then I'm gonna hop in. I'm doing the... That's cute. I'm doing the campaign today. Because if you do... Goggles is back in the square. I don't know who you are, but congrats. If you do every single campaign mission with the same weapon, because it forces you your first time through to, like, try different weapons... Uh, then you can use that hero weapon in multiplayer, and there's... <laughs> My name is not sorry. Oh, man. Most of these... Most of these... Sometimes there's good drawings or funny things in here, but most of these are usually the same thing. Or it's just kind of hurts to look at. But yeah, there's not really a point to me doing this other than just having it. I'll put down another Pikachu for you. Link sent me this thing a long time ago about having, like, you can have, like, pets on stream or something. That, like, walk around and do shit. I don't even, I'm gonna be honest, I don't even remember specifically what they do. Or if they're just kind of there to be there, but... I'll consider it. Mm, he's multiplying. There's one in the middle of the screen right now. It has a gun. <laughs> oh yeah, my Inkling. I get to play as my Inkling. Alright, so... Uh, when I played through this, I never upgraded anything but this one. Because it goes from being like a basic bitch normal weapon to like... This bullshit. Or just shoots everywhere. It's a fully shielded enemy, which has way more health than it should. I think I can upgrade things here. I didn't even unlock the other bombs, which is really funny. Ink ping. Increased power when flinging and rolling also increases speed at which you fling. I might as well upgrade it if that's the one I'm using. I'm going to do the roller today, by the way. Just one upgrade to max, huh? It's not bad. Probably unlock. I'm only gonna use the splat bombs. I don't care. Awesome. I also have so much ink. My ink tank on my back goes down so slowly, it should be gone already. Well, that's awesome. To have that much ink. Scree! <laughs> not like the other weapons. Hi, Star. Ooh, it's kind of not all the way against the wall, and that's bugging me. Like, I'll leave, like, that pixel of space, but having it, like, that far away was bugging me. I don't know, I kind of like this layout. I think this looks kind of cute. If I can throw other stuff onto it that doesn't, like, mess with the gameplay, then that's also good, but... Okay, so... I've done... most of the campaign again with the hero shot. And I've gotten all the scrolls and all the collectible shit, so I don't have to worry about that. I just have to beat the levels with the roller, which includes the bosses. 
Which means some of these are going to be kind of painful, and I'm going to have to keep looking at that Taroma. <laughs> but that's okay. I think it'll be. I think it'll be a good time. I'm probably going to mess up a ton, but we'll see. I'm honestly expecting and kind of hoping that I mess up a lot. Because I don't want this to just be so easy that nothing matters. I don't really remember these levels too well either, though. It's not really in the way of anything. Also, the... Oh, yeah, I was supposed to... <laughs> Silly tutorial. Oh yeah, the only thing that the chat is blocking right now is my lives counter, which I'm pretty sure you can see it anyway. I'm not looking at that display, because I don't have to anymore. I feel like I just don't have the hand-eye coordination to play video games right now, and I think that's even better for the fact that I'm playing this right now. The mint color is really nice, yeah, I agree. Kind of fresh. <laughs> Man, I was playing Demon Slayer ranked this morning, which is also kind of why I say I don't feel like I have hand-eye coordination just ability to play video games right now, because that went not, like, bad, but it could have been way better than it actually was. But, uh, I kept telling Link that I was getting cooked and shit, and then I booted this game up, and I forget that the off-the-hook thing is don't get cooked, stay off the hook. So now I feel like I let Pearl and Marina down. I can reset the camera with Y. I did not remember that, I will not lie. She definitely says that the one time here, and I just never remembered. Scrub quotes get rolled. <laughs> well, that's one of a lot down. Being able to stream this is also good because it's just an excuse to force myself to want to do this thing. <sighs> I have to do the whole world with the roller. But yeah, good excuse to force me to do this. Because it's fun, and I probably would do it on my own if I were just doing it on my own, but streaming it means that if I do something really stupid, other people get to see it. And that's both terrifying and also exciting. Kind of magical, too. I would think nothing of the fact that I'm missing ink piles trying to swim fast. I'd just kind of be like, eh, that happens. Well, since I know I have a chat of other people watching me here, it's like, if I mess up, everyone's gonna want to point it out every single time it happens, and that's kind of magical. I definitely did that in the slowest and worst way possible, but I don't care. 
I am not. I would never. Oh, please. <laughs> She looks so silly carrying that giant fucking roller around, too. Oh my god. I just want to hit either him or the sponge and just have it work out, not both. I also don't know since I don't have hero weapons, and I doubt it would work this way, but I'm kind of curious if, uh, oh, Splashdown would have been real nice to have. That's just more eggs if I carry it to the end. Um, I don't know if I level up a weapon in this mode if it carries over to multiplayer. Because Star and I were definitely fighting somebody with a roller. A hero roller that felt like it had the power of a normal splat roller but it was going as fast as a carbon roller which is the faster shooting one but weaker so i don't know i really i almost choose to believe to doubt that it works that way because i don't want to live in a world where playing the campaign for 500 million hours gives you an advantage because you'd spent <laughs> your eggs to upgrade your weapon in that mode to make it as good as two different weapons. Ugh, and I feel like I'd hear a lot more about the weapons if that were the case, but... I don't know. I'm curious. It is a multiplayer game after all. This is true. Yeah, I'm okay. If it's a cosmetic for my 1,000 hours, that's... I'm okay with that. That's what every game already does. So I'd be okay with that. Giving a, like, distinct advantage over other people, though? Kinda don't... Kinda don't love that. Oh, don't they show dualies in this level? Originally? Because you can, like, slide onto the rails using dualies. Something like that. The last time I did the campaign was in handheld mode in the car on my Switch with the motion turning still on. Which motion turning is smart to have on, mind you. I've just not, I'm not comfortable using it. I don't think it feels good. So, I don't use it. I really should go back and buy the curling bombs. Just so I can throw them in situations like that. Oh, they definitely want me to use this. That's nice. It's a fun fact, too. You can throw bombs on those little boost pads and they boost along. Ooh! That's another fun fact. You can die in this game. <laughs> Wipe out. 
Oh my god, you know what would be really fun? As if I could get people together to play shitty old Wii games, like the shovelware games. Like Wipeout. Or like Cook Wars. Ubisoft's Cook Wars. Oop, that's not right. Oh, that's where all of those go to upgrading your gear, so I don't have to worry about that, it's just eggs. Nice. I love that you throw a liquid so hard it destroys the wooden crates. <laughs> yeah, it's great. I knew you would be down. I know Link would always be down for stupid shit. We're gonna skip cutscenes and stuff too, because I'm just trying to go. Just trying to go. What? Oh, I can just do this because this is the easy version of the boss. That wasn't a normal splat bomb. I'm not used to having multiple bombs. <laughs> well. First world done. Five, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, because that's... They did, uh... What's his face? The samurai dude. He was the boss fight. Finna cook this squid, call it takoyaki. Finna eat this squid, call it cannibalism. No, dude. Don't do that. I think Omega is a squid? Squid Omega? Ooh, burner, burner. I can't take this fucking song seriously because of my brother. Don't forget to jump when you're riding rails. I think I completely just ignored her trying to tell me that I can jump off rails, and then... She keeps trying to remind me and I just keep ignoring- ooh, shout out Java! I know this is pointless. Yeah, I can't even use the ticket. I already have it. Jumping through these rings is like wasting a whole second for a few eggs. That's what we call not worth it. I say as I do it anyway.
jump through the onion rings? I'm sorry, sweet. <laughs> I'll jump through the next onion rings. See? I got you. Don't worry, I'm hip and cool. I can do hip and cool things. Also, hi, sweet. It is fun. I'm having fun. I'm doing fun things right now. <laughs> Diego, if you played this game, you would hella just play the roller, right? Like, to, like validate me on that. Oh, Tina. Hi, Tina. That was really cool. <laughs> it is definitely a U weapon. A hundred percent a U weapon. Get them weapons. I'm um, I'm doing. Oh no. Shields. Was oh, that a squeegee? I love those dudes. They're so fun. They like kill you instantly, but they're fun. I love them. Uh oh. Of course Marie's breath would smell fishy. Yeah. Can't hit it. Yes I can. What? There's a secret balloon? For five? <laughs> oh my gosh. Sent home? Oh. What happened? Oh. It's just a big misplay for me. Oh, that way. The bomb. Big boom. I have to unlock him. I'm gonna get you out of there! Not a video of a dude like yelling at a cat or something. It's like through a door and he's just yelling like, I'm gonna get you out! can just end the turn like that. Well, that's neat and helpful. Was it a cat or a raccoon? I'm pretty sure it was a cat. If it was a raccoon, I feel like I lied to myself pretty badly. I've told a few people about this, but I feel the need to talk about it on a stream. Uh, my cat, Vivian. Um, my dad was coming home last night, so I had to go outside and, like, move the truck, drive it out of the way so he could park his, uh, his vehicle in the spot. And my cat, Vivian, she has to stay outside because she's not allowed in the house, which I kind of don't like, but I don't really have power to do anything about it. Anyway, um, 
she ran underneath the deck out there and just kind of, like, had something in her mouth and I was really confused. So it was just kind of like, what what could it be? What could she possibly be holding? Uh, she had a dead rat in her mouth. I'm sorry, am I supposed to kill these guys and get a key? I wasn't paying attention. Let me stop being bad at video games for a sec. I'll stop Twitch acting. Oh, I've had a key. Wait. No, I'm just blind. Ugh. That's what the name of this called, throwing for content. Um. But yeah, she just kind of had a rat in her mouth, which I thought was really funny, but she kept wanting to give it to me, and I'm just, you know. I don't really want it. <laughs> it's, the, it's a whole dead rat. I don't know what kind of... what kind of shit it's got in it. So she kept trying to give it to me for a good, like, few minutes. And I kept kind of denying it. Because I didn't want dead rat all over my foot. So at a point she just kind of stopped trying to give it to me. But then she started to suplex it. Like, she- I- it's so hard to explain why she kept jumping at it the way she did, but she kept trying to, like, suplex it. Okay, but listen, I'm also not trying to escape from prison, IRL. <laughs> Oop. There's Star. Playing Smash. Um... Oh, it's not a inkable wall. I don't know why I made that so hard on myself. Got to a point later where she just kind of started to shove the entire rat's head in her mouth. Which, you know, I'm not gonna stop that. You go, girl. You, you killed that. You killed that rat. You do what you want with it. <laughs> I had to come back out later to help my dad bring shit in, and there was just a rat body without a head. <laughs> Which was the most, like, I know she was, like, chomping on the head. The prison of I don't have money? Well, I would have money if you guys shared the stream and people subscribed to me. Share the stream, by the way. Tell your friends. Oh, uh, but yeah. Moral of the story is, there's still a dead rat outside. I thought it was just the head. I thought the body was gone, and I was like, oh, you know, whatever. Uh, no. The in Oop. I got debated. Keep acting like I don't. I found the body, too. Link, that must be your, uh, unwellness speaking. Fuck. That was perfectly charged and everything. I'm gonna die. Because I'm just running at them. Just gotta growl if I need a name. Yeah, name it Babushka. Name it Dead Rat. Oh, I'm hella supposed to just go from the side. Wait, I'm making this so hard on myself for no reason, because I'm just not paying attention. I'm trying to just hold W and win. Sorry, that's the inner Overwatch player in me.
I'll catch a retarder for that. <laughs> oh no. Oh shit. Babushka. Big babushka moment. Can I just paste this on my overlay or no? Does that not work? No, I just pasted another Pikachu. I need to see if there's a way I can just more easily do this, but for now. There he is. Babushka. He's real. I don't even want to know what's happening in that. What? Remind me not to ever tab out. I'm about to start getting sidetracked. I don't know what the fuck that is. Okay, anyway. What the fuck? Isn't there a picture of Squidward that looks like that? Am I crazy? You're gonna go have a good one? What? Why are you leaving? I'm just kidding. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, I forgot these maps existed. Oh, I forgot these maps existed. Where did she go? These are like those, uh... Those silver stars or whatever from Mario Galaxy. I'm spending so long trying to remember what it's called that I'm just getting the shit beat out of me. Yeah, these are like the silver stars from Mario Galaxy or whatever it was. Mario 64 DS. I'm gonna see if you can stomach food. Good luck with that. I wish the best for you. jump away? What happened? Can the Octolings jump away? Is that a thing? Am I going insane? stand there. Friend? Oh, not friend. Oh, I activated. I activated the boss. Oh my god. This is gonna suck with weapons that I don't like using. I'm just realizing that. I don't even particularly like adore the roller, but the roller is easy to use. Ugh. But when I get other weapons that I just don't care for, 
Don't I have to use the Brella? I'm gonna have to do Brella at some point. That's gonna be a nightmare. I reckon. Yeah, Brella, Splatling, Blaster's probably not gonna be awesome. That's okay. I'll manage. Alright. Two down. Three to go. All of Sector 3. Literally all of Sector 3. Okay. Oy, 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 oy. This is a fun campaign to go through, by the way. Splatoon 2? Great game. Fun game. Hardest part of this game, especially with the multiplayer, is just getting to the point where you have weapons that you, like, want to use, or even weapon combinations that you want to use. Because there's different types of weapon combinations. The normal splat roller gives you, like, a curling bomb and the splashdown super, and then there's, like, another of the same roller, but it gives you different... I don't even remember what they are, but it's, like, different variations of it. And then there's the, like, actual different variations of the roller. There's the carbon roller that does less damage and swings faster. There's the... Fucking... What's it called? I don't remember what it's called. I'm blanking, because I'm not a real Splatoon player yet. But yeah. Oops. Definitely thought there was ground there. Started going into schmoob zone and then forgot it was campaign. Uh-oh. What I got on there anyway. Where am I heading? What am I breaking? Because I need a key, right? Not the idea of this. Or am I just moving forward? Yeah, I need a key. Do you have it? Oh, it's in. Duh. That makes sense. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna keep spreading Splatoon propaganda, because I think the game's fun. so bad at this game, though. Boing. That dude just got cooked.
If anything, I think the only part of the campaign that I really didn't like was having to go around the hub areas. Because you have to, like, explore them and then the levels are semi-invisible, so you have to shoot them. Not bad, I just didn't love having to do it. Mm. These guys are also not fun. Usually they have keys, they throw bombs behind them, spit ink behind themselves. There's a level where they're introduced, so it's not gonna be that bad. For the most part. Man, I can't wait to get to the levels where they made me use a fucking charger. And I'm using the roller. That's gonna be crazy on the slosher too, probably. Like, the whole gang of people that I play Splatoon with have all shown up. Java, Star... Sayox. I thought for sure that ink was gonna land over by me more. Oops. I feel like slow moving curling bombs are the best way to get rid of those guys, but then at that point I'm just using. Just using splat bombs that move slowly instead of. <laughs> bombs. At least this thing kills them so quickly. Or a donk if it didn't. Sploon! Yeah. Sploon. Jar. Ooh, I remember doing this one in handheld mode in a car. Too close to him. There's one underneath me too. So I need to get you to go back this way. And then I need to get enough ink to throw a bomb that other way, probably. Hmm. That's whack. Oops. I feel like whenever I did this with the hero shot too, it wasn't that bad. But that's the hero shot, so of course it wasn't. Oh, well that works. Get him surrounded. Where? Back? Back. Bomb. That'll hurt, but I had armor, so it was fine. What in the fuck? Noises that I don't like hearing.
Hey. Can't believe it's already almost been an hour. Oh no. <laughs> bye bye, dead rat. <laughs> was this level 11? I lost count. Yeah, it was. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, gee, hold on. I almost forgot to do that. A uh, yuck. All right, everything's fine. Bounce pads. doesn't notice me. That's just how that works. shot. What a fucking blunder. <laughs> no hubris. I lived. It's hubes again. <laughs> I just want to rush through it. I'm not patient enough. And there's a switch on the other side of that bounce pad that I need to hit. Because I want to hit it. What? Secret balloons? That could have very easily gotten me killed again because I'm not paying attention. those guys are called in the story mode, but they're like the story mode equivalent to the grillers from the PvE mode that I did with Star last time I streamed. Oh, so we found it, yeah. No way. I'm gonna get you out of here! I promise you, I'm gonna get you out of here! <laughs> oh my gosh. Is this 12? Yeah, because it was the boingy boings. This is the... Ooh! 
The moving floor one. Yeah, this one's probably gonna kinda suck with the roller. That's okay. Be able to get it spinning really easily, which is nice, but. Oh my. Please! That's how you do it? Oh my god, is that a reference to Friday Night Funkin'? Hmm. Can I hit that from down here? Surely, I have to be able to. Shoot this way. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> Damn, this is like a real online experience. You just team white four people just because you're standing above them. Don't feel right. No, because I can't ink that. There's boxes, though. I do not have a problem. What? Why is Marie so mean to me? <gasps> Secret enemy. <laughs> Oh, because there's a grappling up there. Duh. Oh, yeah. Sure. Turn this way. Yeah. Keep putting myself in situations like that where I have just barely enough time to get out and then I keep being like wow that sure was barely enough time to get out folly of man triangle in the way. I'm blind. <laughs> That's definitely just on there for decorative purposes and I just got killed by it.
Okay, but imagine. <laughs> a guard name uh fucking amity spell it however you want but amity unless if it's a boy then just name it eddie Awful way to spell that. <laughs> M Eddy. <laughs> Fuck, I love that. Whoa. Oh, Sheldon the funny man. Haha, <laughs> don't get my car washed here. Haha. <laughs> you okay, Asian <laughs> Poor? Doing great. Don't worry, I wasn't in actual pain from all that fake laughing I did. How are you still alive back there? Literally how? Oh. Yeah, I should stay in a squid to go through the floor, huh? Octo sniper. Boy, that sure is neat. I feel like going through the normal campaign is being scared of everything. And then going through Octo Expansion and trying to do things with like every weapon is learning that you shouldn't be scared of anything. You don't have to be scared of things if you're good enough to not get killed by them. <laughs> Rolling over him almost bounced me off of the map. <laughs> Ooh, switches. saying nothing gets by me. But there's definitely things getting by me. <laughs> I got pranked by the other color. That's okay. I'm so close. I can do that. Surely. I can keep lying to myself, too. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have the patience to just get down and shoot one more time. I almost fell again anyway.
Oh shit, bucket? Oh, buckets are so annoying at close range. Doesn't help that I'm also just... Not good at this game. So much harder than it needed to be. Can I jump down? That was too far. No, it wasn't. Welcome home, Tina. Which, uh, which Pokemon are you playing, Diego? Oh, this again. Oh, I didn't realize. Or remember. Remember for that matter. Renegade Plat, which is actually hard. Oh, does it drain my ink? Oh, poison's kind of cool, actually. I didn't know that. Yeah, that looked about right. If it weren't for the fact that I had literal plot armor, because the single player gives you the armor, that would have killed me. And that's very Splatoon-like for two rollers to do that to each other. back. I don't need to go up there, I don't know why I was bothering. It's just a wave of non-stop rollers, isn't it? I don't care. The poison won't kill me. Fucking the box might. Box gets in my way. I'm not ready for it. Where is it? Where's the light? Up there. All the way at their base. There is a way over there this way, is there not? I think it's that wall. I'm running. Nice. Stomp. He's the biggest stamp. So technically, Octo Stamp was not incorrect. He's gonna charge at me, right? Yeah. I forgot. Uh, 
Yeah, probably the smartest thing I've ever done. <laughs> Someone skipped leg day. Oh, shit, he got aim. <laughs> Probably already talked about this when you weren't here, but how do you unlock it? Uh, you have to be... Oh, dear. That's not a curling bomb. You have to beat every level in the campaign with one... The one weapon you want to get, basically. I'm okay doing this. But this is what ends up happening, and I just keep tanking it, because I keep getting my armor back. <gasps> Me not getting my armor back, pictured. Colorized. Uh, you have to beat every level in the campaign with one weapon. When you originally do the campaign, it changes the weapon that it forces you to use. That was really bad looking. Uh, it forcefully changes the weapon you have to use. Oh my god. I'm just an idiot. He backed off? Why? Oh, because you have him back. I know that there are people that speedrun the bosses and this game in general, and I know that it looks really impressive. But I don't know how to do any of that stuff. All I know how to do is occasionally throw a bomb for extra damage when I'm trying to break off the pieces. There we go. And no, I could imagine that a lot of the boss fights either use the roller or they use the hero shot, to be honest. Or the the charger, the sniper. One of those three. I can almost guarantee that they use the sniper, actually. Sector 3 done. I'm not good with the sniper in this game. 16, everything but 17. Awesome. Ugh. It's not horrible doing it with different weapons, but some of the levels are, um... As you can see, like, the first and second weapon are the ones that I've done it all on, but if there's, like, an extra stray weapon in there, then that means that's the weapon they wanted me to use in that one. Oh, I must have done one of them a long time ago, because I remember there being a sniper one early on that was a pain in the ass to do. But like, but like 18 here, 18, there's just the hero shot and the sniper rifle. That means it was a sniper rifle level, and I went through it again with the hero shot, which I'm not done with yet, but I almost finished it. And the reason I'm not doing that one first is because I think using this thing would be really boring and not challenging at all. Not that using the roller is making it super challenging, but... It's definitely not me just holding forward and shooting, which would be a lot easier than just using this thing. Ooh, balls. Yeah. Also means I'm gonna have to go through the final boss again with this weapon, I believe, and... Ooh! I did the final boss the one time, and then forgot all about it, because I do not remember having a lot of fun doing it. 
People really hype up the final bosses in Splatoon games, and they're like cool in concept. But I just. I, not for me. It's good curling ball. At least the music's good. Shocked I'm alive. Uh, okay. Big balls. Okay. I have to shoot the glass cage, don't I? Yeah. Okay. This is for a secret. This was not worth it. I already have that. <laughs> we have everything. I definitely found everything on my first playthrough because it's like well hidden, but like well hidden enough that you can just kind of sense that you just kind of have to go around something or maybe do something slightly different. Because, you know, Nintendo game. Game made for kids, when you really think about it. I remember getting all the secrets of my first time through and then thinking, Yeah, this is smart, because then I won't have to play the campaign again. And here I am, having to do it, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine, nine more times, approximately. So that's neat. Did that to myself. <sighs> we don't need more ball jokes. They happen way too often. I like that this is a dark level with the big bright destroy my eyeballs like sun over there. Dialogue bits are also pretty funny on occasion. You do that to yourself. You also play Elsword. would be a really cool shot with like the tower everything like that I can't even hit the enemy I don't even have the right bomb equipped do I have the ink? <laughs> yeah I got him that was so pointless it gave me rings though when I killed them which is cool but I couldn't make use of it because I just Ooh. Gosh. 
the new setup that I get to use is kind of awesome, being able to hear stuff. It means I can play Splatoon and react to things the way that I need to. And then, if I ever play Mario Kart again, I can hear that. So that'll be cool. What am I getting hit by? Oh. But, okay. It doesn't have to be that way, buddy. Yeah, I almost just swam off the edge. Whoa! Hmm. No way I didn't kill him. I'll just live. Actually, no. I have a point to prove. No, I'll be able to see. The new setup I have to use is terrible, and I kind of hate it. But I'll be able to see in here. And that's the important part. If I had subs or any other notifications or followers or whatever going off, that would be awesome, too. But, you know. Is this the one with the jump pads? This was definitely a sniper level. No, I was just talking about it, but... I oh, man, this was definitely a sniper level. Yeah! And I was doing terrible at this, because you have to hit these. Surely it's going to be, like, easy and fine, because I'm using a roller. Oh. Oh. Okay. Alright. Uh-oh. That one's not okay. Shame. I don't need that, right? No. Maybe? No. That was a very confident jump for a man that could not see anything. Oh, hello, friend. I don't know if it's gonna work, but there's like a glitch where if you ink most of it and then pause and wait for a second, it inks the whole thing. Yeah. Completely pointless unless if I were going for like an in-game time speedrun or just wanted to show it off, but it exists. I don't even feel like it's a glitch, I feel like it's like a failsafe for in case other things go wrong or bad. Or if I get lazy and do this. <laughs> okay, maybe maybe it is helpful. Never mind. It's like a magic trick. I don't think it saved me any time at all. But it looked neat. I thought that would be enough to get me up. Clearly, I was the fool. Oh, going down, she says. Okay. No, 
Oh. Little stampy boy. That's cute. I'm kinda glad I ran through that, because that was not a fun situation to be in. Just let them do their whole... Go for it. Not a fucking care in the world. Oh, big care. Oh god. Uh oh. I meant them, by the way, not me. I care. I don't want to die. What the fuck? I don't think I want to be here. Thought about it. Oh, put me right on him. Kind of awesome. Hi, Star. Welcome back. You have not missed a lot. <laughs> okay, what the fuck? Sorry, am I? Okay. Is it the boxes? Oh! Oh, I see. How far did you get? Uh, I'm in the four... fourth world now. So I'm getting there. Uh-oh. Getting nowhere, actually. Fuck. Come over here, chase me. Good. Don't, don't do it. I changed my mind. I don't want you to do that. <laughs> oh, I was doing fine. shower head. Watch my step? For what? Oh, is this another... 
This is a level I don't remember. Please, dude. Oop. Man, I don't want to put up with this right now. Not with this weapon. Just get enough to cover it, please. <laughs> I'm getting too impatient. I just want to be done with this stupid weapon. Now I go this way? Oh. Now I go this way. I, why did I go this way? Are you trying to compliment me and I just goes right over my head because I don't feel like I did anything. So why did I do this? What was my purpose? I'm so confused. Fuck. I'm also stupid. Oh wait, throw a bomb and then go. Yeah. That would also make sense, huh? Temple. <laughs> Is that not right? That was definitely right. Yeah. I just clear this out so I don't accidentally ruin everything by swimming poorly. <sighs> <laughs> not me not realizing how much I have to just run. Oh my god. <laughs> that one I definitely just missed. Okay. I promise I stopped being dumb. It's not a long shot.
What a pain. <laughs> Oh, this stage. The blasters, huh? There's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'll do this one and then I'll go right and then I'll work my way up. These boys, awesome. That'll work super well with these uh roller. All one of my options that I have. Super good. I'm kind of surprised I didn't get hit, but the movement was good, so it also kind of makes sense. I'm okay with that one too, because that was a slosher from above me, so of course that's gonna hurt. I feel like I missed one though. Low ink! No, dude. Not like that. No, it's just the. Uh, one that I missed, where? Oh. Yeah, I did definitely miss that one. That's okay. Ooh. Cool. That actually went incredibly well. And that should be World 4 done. Minus the boss. So I still gotta do the boss. Yeah. And then five more stages after. Not bad. Can't believe it's already almost been two hours of this. Doesn't feel like it takes that long until I realize just both how many stuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuu
Hello? Worst ink pattern that I've gotten in my life. Oops. Yeah, forgot about that one. Jeez. Literally not even far enough to hit. Yeesh. No fucking way that didn't hit him. I might die. I'm kind of expecting it. No? Okay. I just have to jump and shoot it. It's the only way. Say that to me now. <laughs> Stingray. Do this again and just hit him once, hopefully. Nope. Awesome. That was my last shot too. Ran out of ink there. Four twenty. <laughs> oh man. What a nightmare. Weed, weed, weed. Five more. 22 through 25 and then boss. Yee. Oh! People who use e-leaders are cowards. <laughs> Thank you, Rod, again for the tier two for a whole year. Wow. That's, that's insane. Thank you, dude. <laughs> okay, I love that. People who use the e-leader are cowards. We'll just bumped him off the map, that would have been awesome. I'm so good at timing those now. Like, I'm not perfect, but I used to be not great with the curling bombs, but I gave it just a tiny bit of time and I got pretty good. There's no path, it's gone. Where it go? Is it now? to the side. Is it behind me? I don't remember. There it is. He's <laughs> kind of a god. Not even. No way, dude.
take it slow as if I would ever do something so smart. There he goes, slowly, back the other direction. That has to be a dead end for him then, right? Like he wouldn't just he wouldn't just take that. Unless well, that is the way to go, I don't know. Kinda of talking out of my ass. Oh, he has the boosters on him. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense, actually. I'm just gonna face, face tank everything. I'm out of ink. I'm just gonna face tank everything, I don't care. I'm tired of trying to be smart. I'm tired of having armor. It was not a nice fight. Hello, Gary. What up, how you doing? Uh-oh. That was just dumb. How many weapons have you unlocked now? Zero so far, this is the first one. Hoping to unlock all nine before Splatoon 3 comes out. Uh, more or less, that's the idea. I just want to get them all for completion sake, but I don't think it's going to be that hard to do it before Splatoon 3 comes out, because it's still kind of a way, a way away from us. On that note, very exu- uh, I can't speak English. I'm very excited for Splatoon 3 whenever that does come out. What a bad jump. Uh-oh. Yeah, mow me down, it's fine. I have armor, I can be reckless. I don't know how to aim? What happened to me? I'm washed up. That was like, hiding on power control. Behind the one pixel that the enemy team can't quite hit you at. Or that you just guess that they're not gonna shoot that way. Next to your height. English is my first language, but that does not mean I'm good at it. It's like that meme with the cat. It's like, hey, how long have you been doing this thing? And you're like, oh, this many years. And they're like, oh, that mean you're good at it? It's that with English for me. I've been speaking English for my whole life. Doesn't mean I'm good at it. I'm also not good at Splatoon, apparently. I don't know how to jump on these guys. Not sure what's stopping me from just doing it. 
Leave them with bombs? Yeah, I know. What do you think I'm trying to do? Jeez. Not that hard. Whew! <laughs> that was a new record, too. That's kind of depressing. That's another thing. I have to wonder how long some of these missions took me. Like, 27 took me 14 minutes with the roller. Did it take 14 minutes because I was confused? Was it just a long level? Like, I don't know. I'm kind of scared to find out, too. Still can't take this fucking song seriously. Chris, if you're still here, this is entirely your fault. Boing, good jump. <laughs> Fancy footwork. You still need to buy the weapons and ammo knights? That's fine. Ooh, good jump. I'm not here to be good at the game, I'm just here to do it. Occasionally having the foresight to do something smart. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, Chris. This is directly your fault. Ooh, this is neat. Too scared to try to jump on it and be cool with it. I just want on. but it's not like it mattered. Whoa. Oh, really? Hit his back or his side, but I did, I guess. Okay. Whoa, boing. Let's fade away. Okay, jump. Okay, jump. Oh, how I miss you. This campaign is also just Marie being depressed the whole time, and it makes me kind of sad. Man, all that bonus stuff sure looks cool. Man, living sure looks cool. <laughs> I'm not realizing what's going on until the last second. It's okay.
The more I play it, the more I also realize that Splatoon is just kind of a hard game. Like, you can play Splatoon. It's easy to play Splatoon. But to actually, like, be good at Splatoon and not get your ass kicked by everything, you have to be, like, really good at Splatoon. That kind of scares me, because I'm not good at Splatoon. I'd argue that the kids would even say that I'm bad at Splatoon. I attribute half of that to the fact that I'm not good at using motion control aim, and that's kind of, like, vital. I think I can turn it on. No, I can't. I think an Octo expansion I could just turn it on whenever. I might be wrong. But it's so good and so helpful for, like, doing little miniature aim. I'm surprised I didn't die from that until I stopped talking. <laughs> you can do, like, little miniature aim fixes, I guess. It's like, if I wanted to shoot it a little bit more to the left or right and, like, move my controller to do that, I could. But I don't have it on. I'm not good with it. This pro player, don't lie to me. Better than me and I prefer motion control. Well, you also don't play this game a ton, either. Having them on doesn't automatically make you, like, a better player, per se, but it's so much better to have it on than to have it off, also. VR Splatoon when? If I get a chance to, I'd love to do that. I'd be scared for my life. it ain't me. Nah, you lying. I am not good at this game. Wait, it has VR? No, it doesn't. I combated your joke by showing genuine interest in the thing you were joking about. I wasn't even trying to combat your joke, I was just interested. It sounded cool. It's a bomb, dude. Yeesh. Yeah. I can just ride this cube, can't I? No. No, you can't. My memory does not serve me correctly. I think this means this is gonna be shield boys on this side then, since the other one was the flying dude. Yeah. That's a lot easier to deal with if you just do that. Be smart about it. What am I hitting my head on? <laughs> Stop rolling. No, I shouldn't have jumped. Washed up. But, but you're a really good teammate to have. Well, you know, it probably helps that you can talk to me when we play this game, instead of me being named, like, Murder Death 9000 and not listening to you when you yell this way. 
Well, that's different in general. That's because I play other video games. And in other video games, I have to listen to my teammates or guide my teammates. Oh, just like that, huh? Not really much reason for that last checkpoint, but... Oh yeah, I don't think I'm a great teammate to have, honestly. I just, <laughs> I just kind of do stuff and then die, and then that's it. And I don't have motion aim on, so I can't, I can't aim good. I can aim okay. I'm getting a lot better with just using the stick, but I can't handle having motion on. Fat paladins. I know how to be a fucking. I know how to be a teammate. I know how to communicate. I have a paladins? Yeah, you can vouch for me. That was habit. Seeing the rain icon and then wanting to do it immediately, that was just habit. No jump input? Hello? I push the button and get new thing. Hold my... Hold my rain. What? I thought that bomb fell off, I'm not gonna lie. I thought I fell off, I'm not gonna lie. I thought that was gonna kill me, I'm not gonna lie. Things are just not going great. That was definitely enough. Ooh, that was definitely not land to walk on. Hold on. That one's dead. That one's not dead, but he's almost dead. But that's not good enough to be dead, because they heal. That one's dead. I can't kill the shieldy boy, because I don't feel like it. That's a lot of work. It's opening. Why did I go back? I was scared. <laughs> it's okay, I won't game over. I don't know how to game over. Yeah, sudden confidence boost with confidence that I don't actually have. Dead enemy, who cares? Fuck it. Other dead enemy, fuck it. Squid jump. Cover the switch, not kill myself. Yeah. Ooh, wait. I might actually just waste all my time killing you. I don't really want to put up with one enemy hitting me from behind the whole time. It's probably a special in one of these boxes somewhere that I just haven't grabbed yet. Maybe. I actually have no idea. Oh no. But I killed the other dude with my bomb, I think. So... So it seems like squid jumping is C-tapping, but for Splatoon? I mean, sort of. It's just... 
you know, when you go in the ink, you're really low profile. So you can, like, shoot people and then do that and squid jump again, and it lets you go through, like, the grates and stuff. Which, if you think about it too hard, you're like, oh, that don't make no sense, but... Inklings don't have any ink, uh... I said a swear word and ended it with ing, and then didn't say the swear word, so I just said ing. Uh, inklings don't have any bones in their body. They're just made of ink. So they can just do that, no problem, because that's just how they're built. Built different, one might even say. <laughs> yeah, get... Fried shrimp. Oh no. Oh no, first. We got gophers. You know what? I think you're right. I think I will just fall down. The boneless? That's not a normal bomb. Silly goose. Actually, do I want to hit this one enough times? That's the idea. Yeah. Oh, I can hit him. I think that's exactly right, yeah. I think you can only hear the enemy noises. And also there's like an element of stealth, like if I'm moving this slowly, you can't see me moving, but if I'm going quickly, you see like the shit getting pushed up. I wouldn't really equate it to being as complicated as C-tapping either though, because to go into squid form, you just hold trigger. The complicated part comes from being able to move and shoot and jump and go in and out of the form, like, optimally, I guess. You really want me to hit that all the way from over here? When you're not even registering my ink half the time anyway? When you're out here making decisions like this? Alright, where do you want me to go? I see. Boy, yo, 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 yoing. Wait. I've gone backwards, but I will pick this up, and then jump off. I don't even care that I'm back here again, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just gonna not register my ink like every single time I throw it. Oh, it's right up there. Okay. Oh, she. I realize what it's doing though. Never mind, it all makes sense. Oh. 
I mean, in that case, yeah, it's exactly the same. In that kind of context and scenario, it's the same thing. I'm also gonna do this. So I don't remember which side I need to get on the side of, but uh... Not letting that happen again. Tell you that much. Don't scratch my ear. Don't be a human and have human needs when you stream. All it does is hinder you. Wait, I have to redo the whole thing. No, I don't. I can make that. It wasn't as obnoxious of a design choice as I thought it was. Great. That took so long. <laughs> that level felt like it took longer than the other, like, two hours worth of levels we just did combined. Alright, all that's left is the boss. I really don't want to do this. I ain't gonna hold you. I really don't want to do this. And I can guarantee... If that, uh, that Gary fellow that we had wasn't lying, and I do have to buy it from the shop, I will not have the coin to afford it. But if it's there, that's fine. Oh no. Tried too hard to be cool. I can just splat them. Just need to throw this shit at them. That's it. Avoid his spinning punches. Okay. Yeah, I do. I didn't listen to you, Sheldon. I don't feel any different not listening to you compared to if I did listen, but I will give you the satisfaction of telling you you were right. Oh, she. I'm not paying attention. I'm reading the dialogue. Yeah, I'm not paying attention. I'm reading the dialogue. That's fine. players be like I 
Uh, I had a normal flat bomb, so when I just slammed a curling bomb into his face, I just was like, huh? That's not right. That was phase one. Man. When do I have fun again? Wooyee. Keep hitting him until I show up. Ah, oh, my armor. We. I said my armor, and the first thing I thought of was Torbjorn from Overwatch. And I kinda hate that. There we go. Hmm. Mad disappointing. Dude, Marie just called her sister cringe. <laughs> Phone says no. Damn, that's rough. Fuck. One of the ink. <laughs> Here we go. Well, this is the super turbo mega fuck rainmaker. I just died, I should have just jumped. Imagine you're on flesh and ink calling you cringe. <laughs> Maybe if she just wasn't being cringe, it wouldn't be a problem. Okay, yeah. Do be dinner time though. Enjoy your dinner, brother. Not a perfect shot with that motion, but I can do just enough with it, basically. Oop, I tried to jump there. Tried to flip and then jump. 
the game sub now. I can't aim. Yeet. Star is starving too. Star could go get some McFucking food. Maybe. <laughs> oh my god, Link. We did it. Looks like you used the hero roller here, there, and everywhere. I've got all the data I need. I'm ready to go to retail with this bad boy. That means you can take it into Turf War. Once he completes it and gets it approved, he'll sell it at his shop. Okay. Does that just mean it's in the shop? Or... I don't even remember which one's the weapon shop. But it doesn't matter. I could also just press X and look at the shop that way, but... I don't be that smart. There it is. Been analyzing weapons from a certain place, and I've finally discovered the key to reproducing them. These are the freshest models straight off the production line. I hope they serve you well. Hmm. I just slap some shiny parts on it. So this is just like a normal. This is just a normal roller, then, right? Yeah, this is just a normal roller. It doesn't swing as fast as a carbon, it's just a normal. Yeah. I should be able to just run over. Yeah, okay. Well, that's neat. No. Cool. Well, that's good to know. It's just a fancy looking... Fancy look and roller skin for people to be like, wow, you really did waste your entire time doing the hero mode, the campaign mode, with just one weapon. And that's totally fine. Ugh. Gotta say, these character models are the only questionable thing about BDSP. I believe it. Oh. <laughs> This guy's art is always good, every time. Uh, okay. Cool. Well. I think that's gonna be it for today. It took two and a half hours to go through the campaign again and get one weapon, so I'll probably just do a whole bunch of these. Uh, and just do it one weapon at a time. That final mission's gonna be real boring to go through over and over again with the Rainmaker, but that's okay. Uh, but yeah. Thank you all for being here. Uh, I hope the new, I hope the new layout isn't, like, bad or weird. I think it looks nice, but I don't know. But, yeah. Thank you all for being here. This was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. It was nice to be able to interact with people and just kind of, just kind of do whatever. So, I hope you all have wonderful days slash evenings slash whatever time zone you're in. Because it's like 6.30 here, but I know for someone else it's like 1 in the morning. Or maybe just midnight, either way. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah,
It auto-turned me. That was weird. I was facing this way and it auto-turned me. What? What happened to me? Why did you do that? What happened? I'm so intrigued by this thing that I'm just... Okay. <laughs> anyway. Uh, Y'all take care. Goodbye.